In this video, we will discuss the pathology of medullary carcinoma of thyroid. On gross specimen, this appears usually as a solitary mass or a single mass, but in familiar cases, there may be multicentric masses. Because in medullary carcinoma, there is tendency to develop multiple masses of medullary carcinoma or C-cell hyperplasia. So, due to multiple regions of hyperplasia and carcinomas, in familiar cases, there may be multicentric masses or multiple masses. For microscopic features of medullary carcinoma of thyroid, you need to focus on two things that how do the tumor cells appear and how does the stroma around the tumor cells appear. So the tumor cells in medullary carcinoma are polygonal or spindle shaped cells and they arrange to form nest, trabecula and follicles. And as far as the stroma around these tumor cells is concerned, you have to remember that it characteristically shows a myeloid deposition which is visible as eosinophilic material. And the special stain for this amyloid is Congo red stain. And at last, I discussed in gross morphology that there may be areas of C-cell hyperplasia in cases of multiple familial syndromes. So, you can also appreciate multiple masses or multiple hyperplastic lions or microscopy. So, overall microscopic features are polygonal or spindle shaped cells that form nest, trabecular follicles and amyloid deposition in stroma.